So, last time, the first episode I've ever made on Automation plus BMG, uh, it didn't go too well, it didn't go bad, but it didn't go too well. From one standpoint, you know, the, the editing, the uh, how I made the whole video, first time doing that, you know, wasn't wasn't perfect. From another standpoint, the <laughs> the engine itself, the, how I made the engine, was apparently atrocious. Uh, <laughs> it was my second engine I've ever made, in my defense, but, you know, shit happens. Uh, I'm gonna try and do uh, better this time, I promise, but I'm... I don't know if I'll be able to, because this is... <laughs> This is the third time I've played this game after the last video, so I haven't I haven't tinkered with it in between videos. But if I can, let's see what we can do. So for today's car, I'm planning on making a fucking super saloon. I want I want an epic super saloon, something that's big and these look big. I don't know. These kind of look big, if you ask me. Wheelbase, you know, it's got a big cabin size, <laughs> cargo volume, 638 liters. Uh, seems to be bigger than these. I was between like these and maybe this and uh, one of the older ones. I think one of these, but you know, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna go with this one. Looks a bit too long, but that's okay. That's all fine. So, fuck. So, again, I've got no idea what I'm doing. Uh, we've got a l l aluminum panel material. The chassis, aluminum. So, you know, good. Semi-space frame. I don't know. Aluminum again front longitudinal because that's what we're going for McPherson strut on the front I think that's good probably and a multi-link on the rear that's good probably and uh, gonna throw a bit of quality I know you guys said not too much quality but just a bit quality you know this is this is going to be this is going to be a super saloon so you know you know you fucking we gotta be good okay let's go with a, with a V8 a 90 degree V8 or a 60 degree V8 90 degree V8 okay Made out of um, so d dual overhand cam, of course, man. This is going to be a very powerful car. I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna talk with, fuck about with this a bit later. For now, let's just continue with what we have here and see what we can do for this car. So, oh man, what a forged steel sounds good. Conrods, lightweight forged, and uh, another lightweight forged because this is going to be a super saloon. Never, don't forget that. Do, don't forget that this is going to be a M5. A RS6 competitor, okay. This is going to be a big boy car, and we can't, we can't, we can't have like not good shit, okay. Impression, uh, this is all VVT on all cams, man. Come on, come on. With a bit more quality, of course. It's turbocharged, twin turbines, ball bearing, because it's the age of turbo, so we can't have non-turbo car. I'm gonna look at these a bit later, because we need, we need a sensible power band and sensible, sensible size. I'm gonna go around the four, four point four liter. Uh, engine size because regulations okay regulations injection direct injection per cylinder it is it is it is what new cars are made of but it's going to be a super what the fuck is that that looks ridiculous <laughs> the standard looks like the best out of all of them like looks wise straight up just looks look wise oh direct injection per cylinder yes 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 this is the huh that you can see like this is this just looks like an ls all right, but we want we we want direction direct injection to each of the cylinders. That's way too low, man. That's way too low. So we got a very big boy, very big boy exhaust because this car has a lot of power. Uh, but we have two-way catalytic converter and two baffled mufflers because now actually straight through on the end because we need to meet regulations you know we get, we, get, we got to meet regulations there's no, there's no way to it you know there's no way to it. so it's a 4 liter v8 it's making <laughs> not a lot not a lot turbines seems to be seems to not like things so i'm going to go about and start tweaking shit okay let's start tweaking shit um wait, wait wait that's way too much i want i want this to be slightly bigger though definitely want nah 4 liters is like good all the new, all the new V8s are four liters. I mean, European super saloons, V8s are four liters. So yeah, I'm gonna keep that for now. So I got a bit higher compression and a uh, more aggressive cam profile, which has got us to 277 and 553, 553 newton meters of torque, which is good, very good. From this, I don't want to touch any of this. Pff, do I? Shit, dude. Let's let's make the bore a bit bigger, though. Oh my god. Well, we gain a lot of newtons though. 
We definitely gain a lot of newts. Maybe something that's a way too aggressive of a curve though, like straight up. Because like this is what is this? What does this mean? It's quite full. Okay, I don't care. Nah dude, we're going three hundred kilowatts is low. Three hundred kilowatts is definitely way too low. I'm going for like six fuck dude, I'm going for like six hundred dude. So that's why we've come here. We've come here, we need a bigger intercooler. Where is this the space thing? Okay. Uh we are going to go with a real drive car so it doesn't matter. Big giant giant boy intercooler. It's way too big, okay, fill. It's not good. This is a big car, so we shouldn't have that big of a problem, to be honest. So how much did that affect things? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We need Okay, okay. Yeah, but you can see how it falls down here. We get bigger peak, but it falls down real quick after that. So let's get a nicer power curve without losing too much power. I think that's that's a good that's a good place for us to be for now, intercooler, so compressor size. We're losing newton meters very quickly. Smaller ah that's f that's 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 a nice curve, I guess, not even that much, but wow that's fucking that's a that is some jank shit dude. Holy shit. That is not how we will go. Okay, this has a big hit but it keeps stable. Relatively stable up there. I mean you oh my god, like the power is linear, but the fucking torque is not. I don't know how linear you can make torque though. Maybe you can, I don't maybe just I can't. Yeah, fuck it, dude. Big hit of power. Big hit of power. Compressor, turbine. Okay, so we're changing where it peaks. No, 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 no. Like, this is not bad. We are losing power, but getting a, s a longer power band here. I don't... I mean, we, I don't know if... I haven't I haven't really pay, paid attention to the kilowatts. That's not good. Air fuel ratio. This looks a bit smoother now. Huh? I mean, it's just getting newton meters out of this one. And then we're getting a big fall off down there. We got we got a bit of knock there too. Getting a bit of knock there too. Why don't we throw a bit of quality in there? Maybe fuck about with the compressor again. Oh, 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 oh! Not good, not good. Let's go back. Let's go back. Okay, this is this is this is where we don't have any knock, but still only 374. That's not a lot. They're still not good. Mm, I don't know what I'm doing, bro. I don't know what I'm doing, bro. <laughs> we're definitely just getting Newton meters out of this, but we're getting mm, Conrod. I actually don't know, like how. What if? So compressor is definitely eating a dick. Compressor is eating a fat dick, but that's that's its problem. Okay. Oh man, I like I like what I'm seeing. We're getting fuel mixtures. Oh fuck the Conrod. Shit. I want to keep things good. Nah, fuck it, dude. Just a bit. Let's do some ignition timing, which gets us again. Conrod. Fuck it, dude. Where the fuck is the Conrods? Lightweight titanium. I don't give a fuck, dude. I don't give a fuck, dude. Get the fuck out of here. We're going. We're going for broke, dude. We're going for 600 kilowatts. Maybe not. That seems a bit, a bit, a, a bit much. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. Fucked up curve, though. Fucked up curve. Yo, but Loki, I don't, I don't, I don't want to, like, oh, 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 things got real bad, real quick. It's such a low RPM limit, though. What if we throw some quality onto this thing? Nah, okay. Okay, okay, it's 400, 300, 900. This kick is absolutely ridiculous on a real wheel drive car. It's going to be an absolutely fucked, fucked car, okay. An absolutely fucked car. So... Sounds good though. Is that backfire? <laughs> Fucking nice. Fucking nice, dude. We've got 580. I mean, we got uh, almost 600 horsepower and almost a thousand newton meters of torque, which is very good. This is very, v pretty much where current super saloons are at currently uh, but I the curves a bit fucked still I'm gonna fuck oh wow just one just point five gets us so much more power and uh, oh that's not what I wanted to click up oh, fuck okay so yeah but we got a lot of knock there this is this is absolutely unacceptable though 
this is where we can get to without getting any knock but how do I I don't know how to fix this uh, curve though <laughs> I genuinely don't know what the, how to fix this curve maybe fucking about with these things yeah that's this, I think that's a nicer curve man I'm just trying to get a nicer curve on this bitch <laughs> the engine is knocking ha oh not good there we go okay now we don't have any knock okay okay 541 this is not bad okay it's not bad the crank starts getting bad at even a tiny bit more this is a ridiculous well we can't spend t oh shit what it's fine we can't spend too much time there oh yeah this is going to be a good saloon it's going to be a good super saloon all right body quality let's get that nice and quali qualified reds fine let's start let's start going wild so this car this car being the car that it is wow you can go really wide on that look I'm not gonna go so wide because that looks ridiculous but still that's nice that is ridiculously wide huh <laughs> imagine that oh wait we can actually like it uh, or oh. we can get something like a duck tail by itself yeah that's nice this is nice this has a bunch of modifications so that's interesting because like the other cars we, we've done some of them really haven't I really like the idea that this can have a ducktail of its own that's nice that's nice that's beautiful beautiful I don't know what I just did dude this kind of looks ridiculous now if you ask me this I don't know yeah this ah oh, man nah 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 Cause I, I was going for some weird shit, dude. I think these were the rear end of the car, no? But, I mean, it never hurts to do some jank shit, no. It never hurts to do some jank shit. I don't know, this is not, like, not the worst thing I've ever seen. This is not the worst thing. I mean, probably could have been better, but I need to install mods. I don't know. But, it's, I, I, for now, I mean, that's not bad. That's not bad at all, if you ask me. Considering this is the third car I've ever made. <laughs> I don't think hood vents were... Uh, have been a thing on cars for a while. At least I don't. I don't. I can't recall, especially on a super saloon. But fuck it, I don't give a fuck. We're going. We're going. We're going wild on that one. Okay. <laughs> thing I don't like is how there are no fancy mirrors in this game. None of them look fancy. But I've installed some door handles that look okay, and I've got a gas cap on the car for now. So the car is taking shape. It is. Oh, taking shape. These tail tail light make tail lights make it look great. It's a bit ugly in the back though. It's a bit ugly in the back, but uh, it's pretty cool. Like you can like look through. It's like a nice quirk and feature that Doug Demuro might appreciate of this car. Uh, so yeah, that's that's interesting. That's that's a good look. I think maybe 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 probably not. Fuck, dude. Interesting. The the, the rear end. I just noticed that the rear end of this car is kind of uh, broken. Yeah, that's. That's not supposed to be like that, is it? It's not as noticeable on the tail lights. Oh my god, that's wow, that's fuck. Oh my god, you can. Oh, we got a problem. <laughs> I don't. Know, I like. I like what I fucking mangled about here. It's not that bad. It's, I mean, the rear end. It's not long. If I could just get like these edges a bit like softer, it would look better. I think definitely. I've been looking around to do maybe something else, but I'm feeling what I've got. I'm feeling what I've got. I've got some things added here and there we got a full sunroof panoramic sunroof of course we've got four quad boys this it kind of looks it, it kind of looks good i don't know it just kind of looks good this car is i don't know I, I like what i've got here I, I think i need mods or some shit to add more things to modify maybe i'm just not creative though but i don't know let's let's go on to the next part which is a longitudinal real wheel drive dual clutch seven speed transmission which i uh, fuck dude like no problem i want two f 250 on the on the speedo spacing uh let's so it says that lower gear spacing better sportiness and less wheel spin let's get just slightly bit electronic lsd with a good quality radial cross ply is some old fucking shit dude we got radials on this right yeah radials we got sports compounds that are wide as fuck 295s I feel like it's not enough though <laughs> definitely feel like it's not enough I think we 
305s on the back because this is a very powerful car after all this is a very very powerful car I'm making it just slightly wider so we have the ability to get big tires on this car yeah look at us meaty fucking boys dude meaty fucking boys let's throw on 20s on this bitch man how does it how would it look like without it being in the air is there a button to do that okay we got we got we got things we got things good looking rim material alloy what the fuck dude of course it's alloy we got a nice i'm gonna i'm putting everything on three so for our carbon ceramic six pistons on the front with fat fucking brakes vented discs four piston on the back with fat fucking brakes okay maybe not that fat 335s on the back yeah yeah i feel like we need a bigger brake though brake bad type definitely more up there definitely needs to be a bit breaker also can i see the car like planted on the tray down for us ah, that's good that's good active aero cooling flaps i'm not gonna and uh yeah i'm not gonna fuck about too much with that so five seats yeah a luxury luxury obviously this is a luxury car after all power stealing electric viable ESC pull what is LC St electronic stability control plus something else that's good quality safety advanced 20s good quality oh shit springs active sport yeah dude semi-active dude it's, it's how that's how you, you know you gotta go with that you gotta go with that because this is this is a very very good car Presets, sport, mainly sport. This is a super saloon. Maybe not sport, but it, I don't give a fuck, dude. Right height. Can we see the right height? Let's get it. Not, not too low, obviously, but getting to 21 inches. It's quite big, but trust me, you know, it's big, it's big, but we can get, you know, that's the rear end. 360, but we, we can't actually get any bigger on the front end. Gotta have big brakes, man. Gotta have big brakes for this car, okay? Big brakes. Oh shit, fuck, what is this? Oh shit, what does this mean? <laughs> okay, alright, alright, alright. Let me just fix some of these things. So, rear damper, dampers, dampers, front brake force is high compared to grip. Consider the front brake size or pad type. So let's lower the, let's change the pads to a more relaxed pad. Or maybe I just need to lower the size, but that makes no sense. Like this car definitely needs big brakes. How small of a brake do you want me to put on this car? It's way too small. Nah, fuck that shit. It's, it's lying. The game is lying. Trust me. The game is absolutely lying. I've got no idea what I'm doing. Especially to this part. This, this is like beyond me. Okay, so. Four door. Five seats. 541. Six. Yeah, yeah. A 6.1 lead. I don't give a fuck, dude. I just want to play it. I just want to drive the car on 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 some kind of autobahn. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, cool story. <laughs> cool story. I'm gonna export the car. <laughs> it does look cool though. It looks cool. It's, it looks evil as fuck, dude. A bit high, isn't it? A bit. It's a bit high, if you ask me. But it's a bit too late. I've already exported the car. This is where the bad boys are. It, it kind of looks good. The meme sound man. It still kind of looks good. The RS6 fake. And now the Model 5 Trim 5. Uh, I didn't get a, ni a nice name for it. I didn't get a nice name for it, sadly. Ah, oh, man. It looks good, dude. It looks good. A bit too high still. It's definitely too high. But it looks good. Let's see what, let's see what it can do. I don't even know what track this is. Traction control just kicking in immediately. Alright, well, as we all know, traction control is fucking stupid. How do I control? Oh, there it is. ESC off. So that means we can do... Oh my god! So this is one of those cars where you must... Oh, the engine is really far back. That's pretty cool. This, this car... Alright, let's see if it loses. I mean, a straight line that keeps its composure. <laughs> it's not really controllable. This is a super saloon, but like old school, dude. We're talking like M5E60 type shit. 
What the fuck happened? Excuse me, game? Oh my god. The way the controls are binded. One of these days I'm gonna fix the controls. Wait, so... Wait a second. If What if we... What if I do this? Let's do a nice size comparison. Between these cars. Oh. This has a nicer sound, I think. Well, not when it hits off rev limiter, but like... Yeah, this is... The RS6 definitely a bit smaller. Look at how wide the arches on, on that thing are. Realistically speaking, that's a... S that is the size of like Audi A8 and, and 7 Series and all that good stuff. Like, that's how it looks. Got another one out. Oh shit, ESC is on. That's not good. We don't want that. I mean, we kind of do, but fuck it. Without spinning the wheels, it's not fun. Oh my god, dude. It's got... Oh, oh, oh. It's under serious fuck. Alright, we got some kind of autobahn looking thing. Highway looking thing. Let's see what we can do. 100, like it's nothing. What is that? Holy shit. I would have gone through that like it's nothing. Oh my god, this car has a turning radius of a tick, dude. Holy shit. Alright, let's do a nice launch. It's kind of slow to get to the... From that fucking disgusting power curve. It's kind of slow to get to it. Oh my god. What? <laughs> Yo, no problem. Oh shit. Just kind of spinning wheels like like it's nothing, dude. Oh, second gear wheel spin. Beautiful. Oh my, that's not good. Uh, uh, that is, oh no. Kind of fucking let it let it float it let it fucking go wild. His car is that big. I need to download download maps, dude. I need to ch I need to modify these games like properly. Get some epic mods on them because this is uh, man. I like this car. But you gotta be you gotta watch out. lights up the tires like it's nothing dude third gear third gear it breaks tra traction on this big ass fucking car dude it breaks traction on third gear that's how epic this car is well that's gonna do it for today guys uh thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one